Hey guys! Yes, I'm in my PJs. Hopefully my hair doesn't look too dirty. Anyway, okay, so uh, I'm in a book club. Uh, I'm also in another one, but uh, I don't know if I'll be able to read all those books because I don't have all of them. So let's, I'm just going to put that there. I'm in a book club with, let's see here, two aunts, two cousins, and a friend, like a really good friend. And it's been amazing, like amazing. Um, and so each month, you know, one person picks a book. So I started in August and then it was my cousin and then it was my friend. And then it was my aunt, and now my other aunt picked for December. So, uh, there's, and I want to show you every single one that we have done since August. Now, I know that next year I'm gonna do this video, cause I'm gonna call this like, I'm in a book club edition <laughs> type thing. I don't know if that's a thing, but maybe I'm starting it now. So, um, I'm going to show you all the books and kind of give you like a little brief description a little bit, maybe if I can remember all of them. One of them I know I will not because I have not read it yet. So first book, which is from August and, and I picked this one and it's Hocus Pocus in the all new sequel. I loved this book. And I want to say I gave this a five out of five stars. It's in two parts. So basically it's the original book and the new book put together in one. And it is amazing. And it's nostalgia at its finest. And it's basically talking about, like in the first part, it's about like Max, Danny, and Allison. And their bit with the Sanderson sisters. And then it's Poppy. Okay. Max, Danny, and Allison. Poppy... And two of her friends, I forgot their names. <laughs> My goodness. Um, Isabel. And then the other, the other person's name, you know. Anyway, we're just gonna, and their battle with the Sanderson sisters. And I just gotta say, yes, I love the way uh, the um, covering looks. That's Poppy, that's Isabel, and then that's her friend. And I wish I could remember his name, but it would take me probably like several minutes to, uh, find it. And so, oh, try. Yeah, okay, Travis. Okay, so this is Travis, Isabel, and Poppy. Um, Winifred. Sarah. Oh my God, I forgot her name. Holy crap. I forgot her name, but it, luckily she's not my favorite. Sarah's my favorite. I don't know why. But, uh, yeah. They are making a second movie for it, and I am super excited. Um, so, yeah, y'all need to get y'all's hands on that one. <laughs> this is the couple next door. I kind of now regret taking the dust covers off some of them. Because some of them, like, the pic... Ugh. I mean, it's okay. I like the way this one looks anyway. Uh, the Couple Next Door. And it's by uh, Sherry LaPena. Hoping I'm saying that right. And yeah, I gave it five out of five stars. Um, it's about this couple and they apparently lose their child. Or she's kidnapped. And they lose their crap and lose their minds during this whole thing and yeah it's just <clears throat> I did a re I, pu I put those two books in a review really all these books are in a review 
uprooted was for October and I loved it. It was a little bit slow at first and then it picked up and I love it. Just hate how the story ended because it leaves you questioning things and I am hoping, hoping Naomi Novik is writing a sequel or a second book for this. It'd be nice, Naomi, if you're watching this, which I doubt you are, but we need a second book. You can't just leave it how you did. I mean, mm. but I gave this book a five out of five stars. Um, ugh. What people don't understand is, is, okay, when it says the dragon, it's not really a dragon. It's a wizard. Um, and so he, every, like, I think 10 years, hmm. first yawn. Um, every 10 years, like, he comes and he takes somebody. And then, you know, they're released again and ten, 10 years later. And then he goes and gets another one. But, um, yeah. I love this book. And I know for a fact I'm going to pick it up and reread it. Because it's just, it's that, that amazing. Next is The Accident. And this one is for November. And... Yeah, I gave this five out of five stars. And, like, maybe, like, this much into the book, I already had somebody that I hated and despised. And then, like, halfway through the book, another person I hated and despised. And <clears throat> Yes. But uh, it's, like, a psychological, like, thriller, mystery type, to me, uh, book. And it is amazing. Uh, and, like I said... Five out of five stars is what I gave this as well. I have, so far I have not found a book I have hated so much. <laughs> yeah. And then the new one is, for December, is uh, War Cross, uh, Player, Hunter, Hacker, Pawn, Mary Lou. Um, I want to say when I read the synopsis on this one, it kind of gave me like Ready Player One vibes. I have not read that book series yet, but I have seen the movie for the first one. And so being that I found out that there's a Ready Player Two, which is book number two for the um, first one, I was just like, yes, there has to be another movie for it, but I doubt that there will be. But uh, this gave me like Ready Player One vibes. And look how gorgeous that the cover is but then look how gorgeous it is like without it but I'm keeping it on there I'm keeping the dust cover on but uh I chose the hard copy because of the rainbow lettering I'm obsessed and it's different and I really to be honest with you really like hard copies I will only get a paperback if the uh book I cannot you know that I'm trying to find doesn't have a uh, hardcover. Whew, I'm just yawning. Okay, now I'm gonna put this back in order that way when I show, pick them up as like a stack. You know, it will be in order. So basically, you know, we have read these are the all the books so far since August that we have done for uh, the book club. Um, and, uh, I'll leave a link down below, uh, for the, uh, book club app that I use as well, because it's amazing and trying to keep everything organized is what I like to do. Um, but, uh, I already have a book in mind for next month, but I'm not going to say it in this video because I know my uh, family members watch this video and so I don't want to give it away just yet but I'm super duper duper excited on the book I'm going to be choosing and I kind of already have another book in mind as well for like the next time I get to choose that's only if it doesn't get chosen after my choice for January, but I am super excited. 
but yeah so basically that is it yeah i'm in a book club book clubs are amazing and it gives you different books to read that like you wouldn't think you would have picked up on your own without like somebody suggesting it and whatnot and i am not liking my hair today maybe it's because it mm. but anyway and so <laughs> um i think the next time i post i might talk about a list of books that i'm hoping maybe to read in 2021 because i do have too many to count of uh, books that i have not read yet and so but i plan to i promise you i plan to <laughs> but um yeah i'm super duper excited um and then these are two new books but i'm not going to show them because they came i use thriftbooks.com but i also use their app as well anyway um my kids grandmother got me though they were supposed to be part of christmas and she didn't like the condition that they were in um i'll go ahead and just show them but they're not in the best condition at all it wasn't what she had chose when she ordered them and you know the uh well how they came in and stuff they came in as like library edition and stuff but this one is uh the break with charity hold on let me because that's covered a break with charity a story about the Salem Witch Trials. I've been wanting to read this book for so long. And then The Woman in the Walls. They didn't come in in the best condition. And so she was just like, she didn't want me to open the, you know, and see those. So she was like, I'm just going to give those to you. I was like, okay, that's fine. <laughs> um, but yeah, I hope you guys liked this video. Give it a big thumbs up and subscribe if you already haven't hit that notification bell and i'll see y'all next time bye you guys